Hello MCPASD class of 2027. We hope you are all safe and well and can't wait to welcome you to our MCPASD high school campus, home of two excellent award-winning yet very unique school options, Middleton High School and Clark Street Community School. This video is to help you understand the process of selecting classes for your freshman year of high school. While this video contains mostly information about the course selection and graduation process for Middleton High School, you also have an option of choosing to attend Clark Street Community School. CSCS, as we call it, follows a competency-based learner-centered design where learners play an active role in shaping their school experience. You can learn more about CSCS by going to our website, which can be found on the MCPASD website under schools or by attending one of our virtual information sessions on Tuesday, December 20th at 6.30 p.m. or Wednesday, January 4th at 6.30 p.m. More information and the link to RSVP is on our website. If you have any interest in attending CSCS next year, we encourage you to complete an application prior to our lottery on Friday, January 6th. Students who are still undecided between CSCS and MHS and or are interested in taking a couple MHS courses as part of their CSCS schedule should still complete the MHS course selection process. All CSCS seminars will be selected later this spring. High school counselors will visit both Glacier and Cromery Middle Schools on January 4th and January 5th to talk about the freshman experience, answer questions, and review the various courses and course selection process. As you watch this video, please write down any questions you have for our upcoming visit. At MHS, students are assigned to one of three student support centers, Antares, Capella, and Phoenix. The counselors for the Antari Center are Mike Cush, Marcy Smith, and Sarah Stoll. For the Capella Center, the counselors are Teresa Brown, Carmen DeBilzen, and Abby Helmanek. In the Phoenix Center, your counselors are Gusta Thanis, Kim Gowan, and Jessica Pellegrino. Students are randomly assigned to centers, and you will find out what center you are in when you receive your schedule in August. CSCS students also have a student services team that is shared with the Phoenix Support Center. While counselors will be visiting middle schools in January, that's not your only opportunity to learn about courses. Students and families will have 24-7 access to the MHS course registration website available on the MHS webpage. Look for the section titled Future Freshmen. On this site, you can access the course offering book and the videos that are being shown today. Please review the course offering book and see what classes interest you. There are many courses to choose from and it's important that you know your options. Look for prerequisites. You will only be allowed to take a course if you have met the prerequisites. There are some courses at MHS that do not have any prerequisites, but many do. Your course selections impact the hiring of teachers and the classes that are offered at the high school, so it's important that you choose the classes that you want to take next year. Ask for input from others, teachers you have this year, your middle school counselor, or other adults in your life. How many credits do you need to graduate? 23.75 credits. Of those credits, all students must take the following graduation requirements. Four years of English, three years of social studies, three years of math, three years of science, 1.5 credits of PE that must be taken over three years, 0.5 credit or one semester of health and wellness, 0.5 credit financial literacy in grades 10, 11, or 12. Students are also required to earn credit in both fine arts and career and technical education courses. Fine arts includes courses in art, music, or theater. Career and technical education includes courses in business and marketing, information technology, engineering and technology education, family and consumer sciences, and health science occupations. The amount of credit required in fine arts and CTE will vary by student and is determined by world language coursework completed in high school. Please note that world language coursework is not required to graduate from Middleton High School, but it is recommended and in some cases required for future college admissions. 
Students who do not complete a world language course in high school or who complete level one or two of a single world language will fall under the option A elective category. Option A requires that you earn at least one credit in fine arts and one credit in CTE. For students who complete level three or above of a single world language throughout high school, you will fall under the option B elective category. Option B requires students to earn 0.5 credit of fine arts and 0.5 credit of CTE. The typical course and credit load we recommend students take is seven total credits equal to seven classes per semester. To stay on track for graduation, students must earn at least six credits per year. The instruction forms you receive when counselors visit middle schools will help you to complete your course selections. The following is a process to complete your registration. Step one, review the course offering book and course selection instruction sheet. Step two, go to your My Campus account to enter course selections and print your course verification form. Directions are on the course selection instruction sheet. The online registration window will be open from January 4th through January 13th. The window will close at the end of the school day on Friday, January 13th. Course selections are not first come first served. All requests are accepted until the established deadline and there is no priority or preference given to those who submit first or who submit last. However, you will not be able to make changes to your course request after the deadline, so please take your time and submit requests for the courses that you want to take. Schedule changes may only be made during the established schedule change windows next year, and changes are not always possible. So what comes next? Get your questions ready for the high school counselor visits at your middle school, KMS on January 4th and GCMS on January 5th. If you are interested in attending CSCS, submit your application on the CSCS website by January 6th to ensure you are included in the lottery. Read and use the course selection instruction sheet that you received in class. Remember to read all the pages. Have more questions or want to get a sneak peek of the high school? Come to Future Freshman Night, Wednesday, January 11th in the PAC. We hope to see you there. Need to see the video again? The links to the course selection videos will be on the Middleton High School website. Log into your My Campus account and enter your course requests. Instructions for online registration are on the course selection instruction sheet. There is also a tutorial video you can access to, and follow the steps. The course selection window in Infinite Campus will be open from January 4th to January 13th. The window will close by the end of the school day on January 13th you will not be able to make any changes after the window is closed. Welcome, Welcome to, to high school. school. See, See you in January, January future, future Cardinals. Cardinals.